Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. If you are just joining me now then please hit the subscribe button and if you'd like to see any more of me then check out my Instagram, I'll leave that down below. So today's video is going to be a exposed seam collection from Opoly and obviously as you can see I'm wearing the first outfit. It's this gorgeous brown bodycon figure hugging dress and I do really like the exposed seam collection because I just think it looks so different and it just gives like what would be a plain bodycon dress a bit of jazz and this dress was £32 so it's not the most expensive dress in the world but it obviously it's still not a cheap dress so you are getting what you paid for like it's not see-through or anything which is amazing so yeah that's the back all the exposed seams go all the way around and obviously you have this on just so that people don't wear the dress and then send them back so yeah this is the first item I think it's so nice like I got my dress in, I think it was either a size small or a size 8, I'll leave up all my sizes on the screen. And I do like this part, I just, part of me feels like I wish it was a little bit further over, I just feel like it would be a little bit more flattering if it covered up just a bit more, if it was just more of a wider strap maybe. Because I do feel like when I'm moving around, I just feel like if I move too much that maybe this will come down and then I'll have like an slip or something. But apart from that, I do think it is a really nice dress. And at the back, I don't know if you could see before, but it's a crisscross. It's not a racer back or anything. So, I mean, I did it. I assumed it would be a racer back just because of this shape at the front. But, like, obviously when I tried it on, I realised it's not. So that's nice. Bit of exposed back. Love that. So, yeah, this is the first outfit. I feel like it's becoming a thing where I don't have a haul that doesn't have some kind of green going on. Is it just me? No. I always seem to have green because I love green. But yeah, so these are the next two pieces. And the top is £22. The joggers are £40. Now, I don't know if these joggers are worth £40. Like, if you're into, like, the super baggy look, then these are great. I feel like I just... I do... I like joggers that are slightly baggy, but I do like when they have a little bit more fitted to them because <clears throat> even though I think they do look nice on the bum the legs are very big like they're really like quite long as I said in other hauls I am five foot five and a half obviously if you knew then hello I'm five foot five and a half so if you are taller than me then this would be fine for you it'd probably be like ankle length but these are like quite long on me and I do think this is a really interesting top the only thing is this strap is quite tight and is obviously not adjustable. This one is adjustable and there's still like loads of room. So if I was to pull it as tight as you can, it would be like all the way down here, which I don't mind having the buckle showing all the way down here, but I don't know, I don't think it's my vibe. I feel like I'd rather the top be this on both sides or this on both sides, not, you know, a bit of both. But I think it is such a cute shape though and like I said, love the colour, I just think this gorgeous sage green is just screams spring, screams summer, but yeah, I don't know, I just, I think this will look great on so many different skin tones though as well. So this next one is absolutely stunning, I mean just look at the back on this. Obviously the pink strap ruins it, but I wouldn't be wearing that when you go out, I don't know if it's... Is it slanted? I don't know. It was an absolute pain in the arse to get on though, this top. If you don't undo all the little um, lace detail, then yeah, it's really hard to get on. But it's stunning. I love this detail on the top. I think that just gives it a nice touch. And it's a nice length as well. And it's so, like, thick. So it's really good quality. Like, you're not going to see anything. The only thing is, is, like, my boobs finish here. And obviously if you have bigger boobs than me, which isn't hard, I just feel like you might have a bit of a issue going on. Gosh, I feel like a breath. And there's like boning detail, which I had no idea. Like there's boning detail that goes underneath the arm. It just starts here and then goes all the way down. So yeah, I don't know if that just gives it a bit of structure or something. I'm not really sure why the boning detail's there. Maybe it keeps it in place. Who knows? And the skirt, super cute quite bog standard you know like nice little length and it's nice and tight 
and yeah there's not much more I can say about it really the top is really comfortable like the top of the skirt is really comfy it's not got like really deep digging in um, tight band it's just pretty nice it comes up to a nice height obviously you can pull it down but my belly button's here so I've just got it over the top and yeah it's a nice length and the pricing for this is the top is 30 and the skirt is 28 if I'm not mistaken so is a little bit pricey but I think you are getting a lot with the top like obviously with the back and stuff so yeah I mean was it like nearly 60 quid for this whole piece is quite a lot but if you wanted to like treat yourself to something like this I think it is a good option so I just checked and that green set that I showed you before is called blue why would that be called blue that's green this is obviously blue like this is like a bluey gray that is definitely a green anyway so this is the next dress i just took out a little clip because these are hard to get into like they are not the easiest to get into this one's a little bit shorter than the others um i have noticed i feel like i would be a bit scared to bend over in this but this one i feel like gives me a bit more lift on my boobs and they are really tight dresses so it is kind of like <laughs> sucking me in but I do feel like it gives me a bit more shape. It has, um, like, what do you call it? That rubbery, plasticky material. Is that what you call it? I'll show you up close so you can see. This shiny, I don't know what you call it, grip. Is that what you call it? Grip material on there. Just I think it's because it's such a wide shoulder that it needs it. I feel like it's a little bit wide on me. I feel like I've got quite like short shoulders. So I feel like if I'm... So if I was dancing in this, I feel like it might slip off, but yeah, I think, like I said before in other videos, if you've got more broader shoulders, this is probably fine for you. I do like the back as well, it's got a nice, oh god, what the hell was that? Something just fell over over there. Um, I think it's got a nice scoot back as well, which I think is really pretty, and it's got the same sleeves going on as the last, um, what do you call it, last top did, it's got that nice sleeve and I just think it's a really sexy dress I feel like a bit of a badass in it I don't know it just gives you that really nice illusion on your body all tight love it how cute so this is not for really hot weather it would be more like a night out dress or an evening dress where it's not super hot if you were going on holiday keep saying going on holiday we don't know when we'll next be able to go on holiday because of the pandemic obviously but when we can then this would be a nice option if you're not going somewhere super hot because you'll melt in this it gives such a nice shape though up here I just feel like this square neckline is just stunning how cute I would say if you are a bit taller though maybe this would be a bad option because of it being quite short so for you smaller girls out there this would be a great dress okay so last but not least this is my favorite out of all of them this is what I was on about the two straps that are the same it doesn't completely suck my boobs in so that there's not there this was the comfiest and easiest to get into so that's great the only thing is is obviously the color might you might be able to see your underwear but I'm wearing nude underwear and I don't think that you can see them so obviously you'd have to let me know but if you wore a thong you'd be good to go it's the same as the last skirt in the material the shape everything it's got a really nice waistband i did feel like this waistband was a little bit tighter than the last one but no biggie it was fine so again the skirt is 28 pounds and this top is 20 pounds so probably the cheapest two piece out of them all and yeah like I said it's my favourite because I love this colour I think if I had a tan it would look loads better but that's just my opinion I do think that this is a really nice piece for holidays and vacations when we get to go on them so I can save this for a hot summer's day and this one I do think you'd be able to get away with this in summer I do think that it's yes it's thick but it's it's breezy enough for you to wear in summer especially in England I mean I would say if you're in between sizes maybe go up a size just because this stuff was really hard to get into I'm like a six or an eight mainly an eight so either stick to your size or maybe go up a size if you are in between I would not go down a size in any of this so that's everything I have for you today if you did enjoy this video please give it a thumbs up thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time bye